Alright, so you're a fucking virgin! That's not the point! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is this? What is this? When my belly is doing its business, I find you wenching with Mr. Streamall. Sweetheart, no. oh. Jane, you had best leave. Flagpole. <laughs> Majesty? Yes, Sir Anthony? What are you doing? I'm going to vault this stupid ditch. Nothing stands in the way of me and my sport. Are you sure? Just watch and see what the King of England can do. <laughs> he accuses you of raving like a strumpet in a tantrum. What? He says that if the king... <laughs> He regards you as his uncle. His fucking uncle! How old am I? Beyond my confidence. What am I? I'm only a dancing master. And then there's something else. Someone, some bitch who probably hates me, told me that the king has deliberately invited a lot of beautiful women to court for the admiral's visit. I mean, can you believe that? On the other hand, is it not strange that the King's Majesty was in so little space rid of his three queens? And they suspect that the first, my great aunt, was poisoned. The second, innocently put to death. And the third, lost for lack of care in her childbed. Frankly, sir, if I had two heads, then one would be at His Majesty's service. Alas, I have only this one. I want you to go to Rome, Mr. Cromwell. I want you to force his fucking holiness into submission, if necessary, by telling him that if he does not grant me my fucking annulment, then England will... You've given the Seymours your rooms? Yes, Your Majesty. Idiot. If you were my daughter, I would smash your head against the wall until it was as soft as a boiled apple. Lady Anne Clifford. Do you know how old she is? Seventeen. 